Well, one of the things that comes to mind right now is obviously what the pressing problems that we're facing with the migration problem, the refugee problem. And I think that um, the extraordinary advances in technology will allow us to be much more flexible in uh, placing production units um, where they're needed uh, and not, so in, in other words, where these refugees and these migrants are going to be in the future. Not just production units, but also educational units, health units, etc. Um, so the flexibility that the fourth industrial age are going to afford us is quite extraordinary and it's going to help us improve the lives and the lot of these people um, to a much greater extent than we are able to right now. Well, the same goes for education. Um, if you look at uh, where the vast majority of uh, asylum seekers and uh, migrants are today, uh, particularly in the Middle East, what we're looking at is the potential loss of a whole generation who haven't had access to education for quite a while and won't get it for quite a while longer if things continue as they are now. And it seems to me that technology is already at a stage today where we could potentially um, bring education to these people in, in a much, much easier way than we could in the past and certainly also in a much cheaper way. And we need to think about that. We need to, to do that. And I think that we are going to be able to do that in a much more organized way in the future.